एवरी वन आई एम फाइल एंड वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल आई एम इन ओसलो नो वे एंड आई एम गोइंग टू टेक द नो वे इन अ नेचुरल ट्रिप वॉट इज नो वे इन अ नेचुरल सो बेसिकली द ट्रिप स्टार्ट इन ओसलो यू टेक द बर्गन बना ओ द बर्गन रेलवे ट्रेन टू गेट टू मिड डॉल एंड दिस जर्नी इज फुल ऑफ पिक्चरस लैंडस्केप्स थ्रू आउट From Mirdal, you take the Flom Bana or Flom Railway to get to Flom, and the journey from Mirdal to Flom is one of the best train rides ever. From Flom, you take the Fjord Safari to explore the Orleans Fjord and Nero Fjords, and then you reach Gudbangen. From Gudbangen, you take a bus to Bos, followed by another bus ride. to bogen and that is the whole norway in a nutshell trip now what i'm going to do is i'm going to modify this a bit so i'll do everything except the journey from gudbangen to bogen via bos so i'll reach gudbangen from there i'll take a bus back to flom and i'll stay in flom now i do have some fun activities planned in flom so if you want to watch the norway in a nutshell trip Slash Oslo to Flom vlog. Then please keep on watching. Now, before we even begin the video, let me tell you that I just saw the northern lights in Oslo. So we have come to this lake, which is frozen now, and there you can see the northern lights. Focus, focus, focus. First stop, metal. about to reach Finsa station which is the highest situated station in Norway 1222 meters above the sea level it also happens to be the filming location for the ice planet hoth in star wars the empire strikes back this is the hotel finsa 1222 which hosted the entire cast and crew back then Finally reached Medal.
metal now and this train will take us to Flom. Along with such breathtaking views, they also guide you throughout the journey, which is really cool. So you know things like which side of the train to look at and which part of the journey you are in, etc, etc. Here for about five minutes and you may go out on the platform. Please be careful. Mind the gap and the platform may be slippery. Today, it is a popular walking and bicycle trek known as Oralavegan. First things first, it's time for some treats mm. before we move on to the next part of the journey, which is exploring the fjords. Taking the shuttle bus to get back to Flom and see how lovely it looks in the evening. Ending the long yet fulfilling day with some delicious Viking dinner. This is the dish that I ordered and it's named after Njord which is the god of sea as per Norse mythology. And this is the Viking platter. Everything was so good. This place is highly recommended. Mm -hmm. 
New day, new adventure. Our guide is taking us to a nearby mountain where we'll go snowshoeing, have some hot beverages and enjoy some views overlooking the fjord. Very exciting. The snowshoes needed a little bit of getting used to, but after that, they were pretty comfortable. Our guide can't remember the exact name of the fruit, but it's a hot syrup made of some berries and it's delicious. We are back from snowshoeing. It was really good though. We didn't get to see the view of the fjord from up there because of the weather. It was snowing so much. Uh, but that's okay because the snow was really, really pretty. And now we have a bus in 30 minutes to take us back to Oslo. brings us to the end of the vlog you will find all the details of the tours in the description box it was such a short but eventful trip and if you enjoyed watching it as much as i did making it then please like the video and subscribe to my channel and i shall be back very soon bye